Good morning, students. Welcome to this problem number seven video. Subsidiary books. We are started with the cash book. Cash book of four types that is single column, double column, triple column. Problem number one is single column. Even though it is single column, we posted in triple column cash book. But in examination, just you draw only date particulars, LF number, and cash column. That's that's enough. Okay. To keep remind you the format of triple column cash book, which is very important. I am using triple column cash book format for single column, double column, and triple column. Okay. So problem number seven is exactly triple column cash book. He clearly asked us cash book with the discount cash and bank columns. Okay, problem first one, December first, cash in hand balance brought down 16,000. Next December 2nd, open day bank account with rupees 7,000. So when we want to open a bank account, we have to deposit money into bank. That's why bank account data to cash account. Bank to cash account. In cash account, Second date by bank. Amount seven thousand. And date second to cash. Amount in bank columns. This is contract. This is a contract which is posted both sides. So it is having two marks. You have to remember this. Cash purchases, purchase account data to cash account. Date 3, by purchases. Amount is 600. Received check of rupees 400 from Prabhakar and gave him discount of 24. Check received is treated as cash received. What we received, check that is to Prabhakar account. Amount is 400. Discount 25. So again, I am explaining this. Received a check of 400 from Prabhakar and gave him discount of 25. Usually, check received is treated as bank. But in triple column cash book, first we enter in cash column, later we deposit into bank. Okay, that's why we entered in debit side. Next to cash sales, all receipts. Cash sales. Entry is cash account data to sales account. Amount is 1200. Received check from check of rupees 100 from Venu for interest. <coughs> Directly we can post this into bank to interest. Amount is 100. So, check received is treated as cash received in case of personal. I'll repeat to manager by check. So, it is 9th. 
by salaries. is 450 with due from bank for personal use by drawings account it is withdrawn from bank so from bank amount will be directed purchase by skill for office use 300 date by by skill amount is 300 paid office rent office rent account related to cash account cash account credit side by office rent Amount is 80. Sold goods for cash. Nine hundred. To sales. Amount is nine hundred. Purchased government bonds. Government bonds are investments account return to cash account. By investments. Seven hundred. Paid traveling elements to manager one fifty. Traveling elements account return to cash account by traveling elements. Received commission, cash account return to commission account, to commission, one seventy five, gave a check to agenda for advertisement, so entry will be advertisement account return to bank by check received from Prabhakar on 4th was design. So you see the Prabhakar check. Prabhakar check is which is Prabhakar check is in cash. First we deposit into deposit into bank. So entry will be bank account data to cash account. 29th date by amount is 400. To cash. In bank column 400. Now Prabhakar check is in bank, that check is designed. Simply we will write by Prabhakar. We will cancel everything by Prabhakar. In bank column 400, discount is 20. Prabhakar is cancelled. Okay. Cash in excess of 2000 was paid into bank. That we will see that.
Sixty or zero. That is the answer. Just a moment. So cash in excess of two thousand was paid into bank. Actually, we are having amount is how much? Seven three nine five. Out of the seven three nine five. Two thousand excess means seven three nine five. Seven three nine five is deposited into bank. Okay, now we will post bank amount seven three nine. Cash. Fourteen eight ninety four. Thirteen seven hundred and fourteen five. Okay. Clear. Clear. So here. Entry entries are entry entry entries is second on second. How it will be? They are having cash sixteen thousand. They open a bank account in the sense they deposited six seven thousand rupees in bank. So that is the entry entry deposited into bank or open a bank account. Bank account data to cash account. Bank account data to cash account. Seven thousand in cash column by bank seven thousand. Okay, and one more important in this is we received a check four hundred from Tavakar that was dishonored on twenty nine. So whenever from starting onwards we are remembering the rule is whenever we received a check treated as cash received. That was posted in cash column first. So Prabhakar check four hundred we posted in cash column debit side. Later on twenty ninth the check was dishonored. So if the check is dishonored, where the check is dishonored? Yeah. It is dishonored in bank. That's why on the same day we passed one entry to deposit the check into bank. Check into bank and four hundred. The check is in bank. Check is in bank. Now the designer entry is by Prabhakar. We are cancelling the check in bank by Prabhakar. Is amount four hundred as well as discount. As well as discount. 
Okay, that is one important uh, item in this. Next, uh, last one is like first problem. Cash in excess of 2000 was deposited into bank. So after receipts minus payments, we got a balance of 9395. We kept 2000 in uh, balance and remaining 7395 was deposited into bank. So that for that purpose, for that one entry is bank account data to cash account. To cash 7395 in bank column. I bank 7395 in cash bank. Okay, so debit sum, debit total minus credit total, as well as a bank. The balance amount is cash 2000, bank 13,745. Clear, student? You try and practice. Okay, then you will get a. Okay, now. Okay, bye, students.